Hi friends, this is Pastor Harley from Broadway Church. Um, Ezekiel as, is where we have been reading in the Bible as we go through the Bible uh, reading as a church. And he's been preaching as the prophets, both the ones who wrote a lot and the ones who wrote a little, often spoke in judgment on the surrounding nations. And he's talking about Tyre. Uh, the city of Tyre, which was like a little city-state, had grounds around it and was very wealthy and rich and known for its wealth. But it's interesting when he comes upon this judgment that, that is spoken against them, you hear something else. 2817. Your heart was proud because of your beauty. You corrupted your wisdom for the sake of your splendor. I cast you to the ground. I expose you before kings to feast their eyes upon you. There is that about Tyre that Ezekiel says the, those who ruled over her, those who were at the center of her power, also were expressing the pride of Satan, the pride of, of our very foe, who was uh, an angel of great light and magnitude and rebelled against God. His light has turned to darkness. He is our foe in the world. He is the tempter. He is the one behind and that, that amplifies the evil of men. And, and, as he, and as Ezekiel speaks against the leaders of Tyre, he is bringing out this great sin of pride that raised itself up beyond all bounds, not consent, content to be a creature made by a glorious creator, but wanting to be everything to be focused in around them. We have one of the basic sins of humankind talked about in this passage. And uh, one way of calling it is our self-centered carnality, that it's all about us and it's all about our limited existence in this world and, and, uh, and building up ourselves around it. It's all, and, and so it's, it's carnal, it's of the flesh, and it is self-centered. Ezekiel pounds against that. Ezekiel calls it out into other nations and, and recognize that, that a nation that falls into pride is running up against the will of God, which should be a major concern for any people and nation. So uh, we don't act in pride. Uh, we take that, that moral lesson away. But also we remember that God, over the strength of any nation, is supreme. Amen.